Female astronauts have gathered at the United Nations headquarters in New York to mark the International Day of Women and Girls in Science. The astronauts are encouraging future generations to shoot for the stars and close the gender gap. Women make up just one third of the global scientific community, a statistic that has scientists saying it's time to encourage more women to get involved in STEM. To the generation of women currently in, in the sciences, I say to you that we have a personal mandate to create opportunities for access to education, to mentorship, and to provide the encouragement necessary for these young women to launch their dreams. The United Nations hosted an astronaut-led panel to highlight the contributions of women in science. As the world marked the 10th anniversary of the International Day of Women and Girls in Science, the consensus was clear. We need to remove the barriers keeping more women from pursuing STEM careers. The panel featured 16 female astronauts, making up nearly 20% of all women astronauts worldwide. It's not about you. It's not about me. It's about space to inspire for all of humanity. As of 2023, only 23% of senior management and 8% of CEOs in STEM qualified industries in Australia were female. Astronaut Jeanette Epps urging her colleagues to do more to inspire young girls into the science field. We need to lift each other up at every turn. Science educator Bill Nye thanked women in science for working to change the world. You all will make the world better for all humankind. You are leading us. The head of communications at the UN Spotlight Initiative says the event is a timely reminder that despite the increasing global pushback, the future looks bright for women in science. Let us all join hands to ensure that every woman and girl has the opportunity to achieve her dreams here on this earth or in space or in anywhere in our universe. Julia Seymour, Sky News Weather.